Filum Kinidaria. Like sponges, Kinidarians have been discussed a long time ago about how kind of organisms they are and mainly about their stinging tentacles. Because it, Aristotle named the jellyfish Akalef and the polypus as Kinid. Being both names derivated from the meaning Nero. Renaissance scholars put them among plants, and just in the 18th century, they were recognized as animals. Naturalists from the 19th century classified them together with the sponges and other many groups. Linnaeus classified them among the zoophytes, a group of organisms considered between plants and animals. Lamarck created the group Hadiata, that included the jellyfish cnidarians, kittenophores, and echinoderms. At the beginning of the 19th century, the naturalist Michael Sars demonstrated the polyps and jellyfish are different forms of the same organism. In 1847, Lockhart recognized the difference between Porifera, Kinidaria, Kittenophora, and Echinodermata, created the name Selenterata, from the Greek koilos, cavity, enteron, intestines, to designate the first three groups, recognizing the intestines as the only cavity in the body of these animals. In 1888, Hatchet separated the Selenterata of Lakehart in the three phyla which we have today, Porifera, Kinidaria, and Kittenophora. Characteristics The Kinidarians are found mainly in marine environments and in fresh water too, have radial symmetry, basically formed by a gastrovascular cavity, with a mouth anus rounded by tentacles. The characteristic which gave the name to the phylum is the presence of nematocysts, a set of kinidocytes with our arpon-like net cells. Each kinidocyte contains an organelle called a kinida, kinidocyst, nematocyst, pitocyst, or sparocyst. This organelle consists of a bulb-shaped capsule containing a coil roll tubular structure attached to it. An immature kinidocyte is referred to as a kinidoblast or nematoblast. The externally oriented side of the cell has a hair-like trigger called a kinidocil, which is a mecano and chemoreceptor. When the trigger is activated, The tubule shaft of the kinidocyst is ejected, and in the case of the penetrant nematocyst, the forcefully ejected tubule penetrates the target organism. There are two forms of kinidarians, sessile polyps and free-swimming medusas. Polyps Both in polyps and medusas, the side of animal that has a presence of the mouth is named the oral ended and the other side is named the aboral end. In polyps, the aboral end is also called the pedal disc. It is fixed on the substrate or, when it's necessary, like a foot in unconsolidated substrate. The mouth is localized in elevated hypostome or manubrium, like in hydrozoans or in a flattened oral disc like in Antozoans. The mouth opens in a pharynx, which sometimes have some ciliated furrows, called the siphonoglyph, which leads the water to inside of the animal. The siphonoglyph uses the four orientation. Mesenteries adjacent to the siphonoglyph are ventral. Those opposite the siphonoglyph are dorsal. The celenteron or gastrovascular cavity, is used to circulation and digestion. In the antozoans, the tentacles that round the mouth have extensions hollow of cilantro, 
while in the most of hydrosome, this cavity is filled by solid nucleus and dense in gastrodermal cells. The tentacles can get thin, filiform tentacles, or end in a conspicuous button of kinidas, capitulated tentacles. Some of them are branched, named the pinnacles. Medusas. Medusas have shape of bell, plate, or umbrella, and overall have a thick layer and gelatinous of mesoglea, because it is the name jellyfish. The convex superior surface, abral, is called the exumbrella, and the concave inferior surface, oral, is called the subumbrella. The mouth is localized in the center of the subumbrella, in the far end of a tubular extension, the manubrium, in general present in hydromedusas, but absent in siphomedusas. The cilantro or gastrovascular cavity occupies the central region of the umbrella and extends radially through the radial channels. The majority of the hydromedusas have a thin circular flap of tissue, the veil, in the inside margin of the umbrella. Classification According to World Register of Marine Species, the Philum Cnidaria is divided in seven classes. Class Antozoa The class Antozoa is divided in three subclasses. Subclass Seriantaria Tube dwelling anemones or seriantarians look very similar to sea anemones but belong to an entirely different subclass of antozoans. They are solitary, living buried in soft sediments. Tube anemones live inside and can withdraw into tubes, which are composed of a fibrous material made from secreted milks and threads of nematocyst like organelles known as tycocysts. Within the tubes of these seriantarians, more than one polyp is present which is an exceptional trait because species that create tube system usually contain only one polyp per tube. Examples Serianthiopsis astro-africanus Serianthus membranaceus Paxerianthus fimbrianthus Arachinanthus sarsi Subclass Hexacoralia, comprising approximately 4,300 species of aquatic organisms formed of polyps, generally with six-fold symmetry. It includes all of the stonial corals, most of which are colonial and reef-forming, as well as all sea anemones, and zoantids, arranged within five extant orders. The Hexacoralia are distinguished for another subclass of Antozoa, Octocoralia, in having six or fewer axes of symmetry in their body structure. The tentacles are simple and unbranched and normally number more than eight. These organisms are formed of individual soft polyps within some species living in colonies and can secrete a calcite skeleton. As with the Alcnidarians, these organisms have a complex life cycle, including a motiloplanktonic phase and a leather characteristic sessile phase. Hexacoralia also includes the significant extinct order of rugose corals. Examples Cirripatis spiralis, Trisopatis spich, Leopatis anossa. Plumapatis penacea, Abisopatis lira, Corinactis californica, Discosoma sp, Ricordia iuma. Subclass Octocoralia, comprising around 3,000 species of water based organisms formed of colonial polyps with eight-fold symmetry, 
It includes the blue coral, soft corals, sea pens, and gorgonians, sea fans and sea whips, within three orders, Alcyonaceae, Edioporaceae, and Penatulaceae. These organisms have an internal skeleton secreted by mesoglea and polyps with eight tentacles and eight mesenteries. As with all cnidarians, these organisms have a complex life cycle, including a motley phase when they are considered plankton and leather characteristic sessile phase. Examples Dendronephitia, Clunzingeri, Capinella, Tirsoidea, Isidella, Tentaculum, Paramuricea, Clavata, Isiligorgia, Shirami, Melitea, Ocrácia, Anela, Molis, Coralium, Rubrum, Sifonogorgia, Godefroi, Pitilosarcus, Gurnei, Virgularia, Gustaviana. Class Cubozoa. Box jellyfish are cnidarian invertebrates distinguished by their cube shaped medusa. Some species of box jellyfish produce potent venom. Chironex flecari, Caruchia barnesi, and Malo king. Stings from these and a few other species in the class are extremely painful and can be fatal to humans. Examples Chironex flecari, Caruchia barnesi, Malo king, Morbaca virulenta, Tamoia oboia, Tripedalia cistófora. Class Hydrozoa. Is a taxonomic class of individually very small, predatory animals, some solitary and some colonial, most living in salt water. The colonies of the colonial species can be large, and in some cases, the specialized individual animals cannot survive outside the colony. A few genera within this class live in fresh water. Examples Corimorpha nutans, Equoria victoria, Physalia physalis, Marros ortocana, Olindias formosa, Baticorus Bouloni, Crossota milce, Crossota norvégica, Crossota sp, Dendrograma enigmática. Class Mixozoa, are aquatic, obligately parasitic cnidary animals, and contains the smallest animals ever known to have lived. Over 2,180 species have been described, and some estimates have suggested at least 30,000 undiscovered species, mainly having a two-roast life cycle, involving a fish and an annelid worm or a bryozoan. Examples Mixobolus cerebralis Ceratomyxa chasta Budenbrochia Plumatele, Tetracapsuloides Briosalmone. Class Polypodiozoa. Polypodium is a genus of parasite that attacks the eggs of sturgeon and similar fishes. It's one of the few metasons that live inside the cells of other animals. Example Polypodium idriforme. Class Cyphozoa is an exclusively marine class referred to as the true jellyfish or true jellies. 
The class name is Sifozoa comes from the Greek word Skifos, the denoting a kind of drinking cup and alluding to the cup shape of the organism. Examples Atola, Vivilei, Nausite, Aurea, Catostilos, Mosaicus, Rhizostoma, Pumo, Estomolophus, Melegris, Cassiopeia, Andrômeda, Cassiopeia, Ornata, Cotilorrisa, Tuberculata, Filorrisa, Punctata, Tissanostoma, Loriferum, Ciania, Capilata, Drimonema, Larsone, Crisaora, Isocela, Crisaora, Colorata, Aurélia, Aurita. Class, Staurozoa. It's formed by Medusozoan, Jellyfishes, and Hydrozoans. It has one stunt order. Stauromeduse, Stalked Jellyfishes. Staurozoans are small animals, 4 cm at maximum that live in marine environments usually attached to seaweeds, rocks, or gravel. They have a large antitropical distribution, a majority found in boreal or polar, near shore and shallow waters. Few staurozoans are found in warmer tropical and subtropical waters environments of the Atlantic, Indian, and Pacific Ocean basins, but most are known from the northern hemisphere. Examples Aliclistus Antarcticus Aliclistus Steinegeri Aliclistus Octoradiatus Manania Andi Lucernaria Quadricornis